Hey guys, Deacon here. Uh, a couple of nights ago, uh, we managed to get seven people. Well, we actually had eight at this point for uh, Clan Wars. And we had such a good night that the guys have asked me to do some videos on them. So here we go. And um, this is game one, part one out of five. Uh, I won't tell you what the uh, the overall score was out of five, but uh, it was very enjoyable. I decided I've moved away from my Moscow. I've been using a Moscow quite a lot. And I thought I'd go with the gearing because uh, I feel I can have a bit more of an impact in the game uh, this way. So we'll sh we shall see, see how I get on, how the rest of the guys get on. But as we start here, we'll, you'll notice the map. Uh, we've got two destroyers, myself and Dorky. I'll bring up the, the screen, there you go. So Dorky's in Ashima. I'm in my gearing. And then we've got Derpy, Horus, Lemon, Fragged, and Wardred all in their cruisers and battleship. And we're up against the clan BIA. And we've got Habrosk and the Shimakaz you need to worry about there. What's even a little bit scarier is the two Demons. So let's carry on. We shall see that what I've done to begin with is I've asked Dorky to move over to over to the left and try and cap A from the left hand side and the reason this is really potent is you can get you can get in nice and close there uh, up against the rocks and not be spotted unless obviously Des Moines pop their radar. Uh, I'm pushing C uh, to cover Dorky I've asked Horace to go across the to the De, uh, to cover him over A in his Des Moines so you can pop radar and see things and everybody else is going to push to the south side of C. This has a positive impact on uh, what we can do in one place while holding another. Uh, you will notice that the Hindenburgs has popped up and then the Haberovs suddenly appears and I go stuff at this. I'm not going anywhere near that thing. Now I've got a much better detection than he does obviously. But this gives us opportunity to uh, shoot him down. So it's telling me he's the closest. Also located, so somebody knows where I am, and it tells me that they're directly in front of me. And there's the Shima. Let's actually go into my view, and you can see what I'm targeting at. Cool. So we managed to push both of them back. We know there's going to be torpedoes. We know there's going to be torpedoes. That Shima's going to have fired three sets. It is obvious. There's one. There's two. There's three. So we're currently focusing on the Haberovsk. We've managed to get A, which is a great move by Dorky. He's managed to push in there, take that. And Horse is now trying to uh, get some shots off at a few bits and bobs. cast the die. As I face him one on one, he will eat me alive. But I'm now going to push into C. We need the second cap. Clan Wars is all about getting two caps and then playing defensive. So you start off aggressive, then you play defensive. Turn around and have a look at the rest of the guys. See how they're getting on. They're looking okay. Derpy's taking a bit of a hit. But overall, everyone else is fine. I'm just sat here capping out C. Trying to keep things spotted. I'm spotted again. That's going to be the sheep. There he is. Let's get him to deal with now. He didn't last very long at all. Managed to cap C. Managed to get out of there without taking any real damage. Find 
this might hurt Ward Red. I don't have much choice, I've got to keep going the same direction. I could turn away, but I don't know if there's any more torps. There doesn't appear to be. So I can slow down, let these torps pass me, one on either side. <laughs> You just let the mine go down. I can tell you now that the <laughs> I d I very much believe that that was derpy <laughs> having fun. <laughs> so now we've got two caps. There's a Hindenburg way out on the left, way out on the left. Havros is back up again. Guys are going to try and deal with him. And I'm going to move into the middle. Get that Havrovsk. I've got free reign. Free reign on this map. And it looks like he's burning. And he's dead. But, we've just lost War Dread. The mine coming down the flank. We need to deal with him. Now the Hindenburg away out on the flank. We, he doesn't matter. He's so far out of the game. He's not having an impact. He's actually being slowed up massively well by Dorky. So we don't have to worry about him. Okay, there's no point in us chasing after him. We've got two caps. We've got we've got the positions. is just waiting. I'm checking around. I know where that Hindenburg is. I'm just trying to make sure he doesn't spot me. Concentrated on now. I'm spotted. I'm gonna pop my. I was lucky there. But there's the sonar. And there's nothing I can do about this. I start pushing forward a bit. Now, why have I done this? Why am I moving forward? It's gonna jinx him. Number one. He still hits me, but that's fine. Repair. I haven't fired my torps yet. First set of torpedoes. Second set of torpedoes is turning out. That's why I lead a bit. A bit. You can hit me again. That is okay. And I can get around this corner so you can't shoot me. Don't have an engine, but this is what my stands for. And there's no way he's going to dodge those torps. Okay, I I get the irony here that I put <laughs> I punch a speed boost while I'm uh, oh, I've got no engine, but it helped me a little bit. <laughs> and this game's all but one, all but one. Dorky's done a fantastic job dealing with that Hindenburg all in the flank. Derpe has fired some fantastic shots. I've got to say that Fragged and Lemon, even though they're in rental ships, okay, pulled a blinder. The damage output that these guys do over the, over the next few battles is, is very impressive. I think we might have a, a few people who are a little bit excited about getting themselves their... Uh, You notice I found a nice spot here where I can fire without using any smoke. I'm behind an island, I'm just firing over the top. Just gonna keep pummeling him with some HE shells. I don't I don't believe we get the get the kill in the end, but it's all over in one more tick. And that's game. That's victory number one.